What does Colorado have to do with South Africa, Mongolia, or Patagonia? Demer Botanic Gardens researchers study and collect plants from all these places. Cold, semi-arid parts of the world known as steppes. Steps are a product of their latitude and a rain shadow effect. Evaporation from the ocean creates air masses that are full of water vapor. Mountain ranges catch these wet weather systems, causing a dry region on their leeward sides. The steppe regions scattered across the globe have unique flora and fauna, but their landscapes can be strikingly similar. Mongolia's grasslands rolling up the edge of a steep ridge would look right at home along the front range. Steps are dominated by hardy grasses and shrubs that can survive with very little precipitation. They endure temperature extremes between day and night, summer and winter. The plants are adapted to drying winds and to grazing. Grasses, for example, use the wind to carry their pollen. They can re-sprout from their roots as their leaves are nipped off by grazing animals. Denver, Colorado is at the heart of the North American steppe, and residents know its steppe climate well. Winter snowstorms, often followed by sunshine and clear blue skies, or unpredictable spring and fall frosts, and the dry heat of summer with threats of tornadoes and hail. Denver's green canopy of deciduous trees and network of urban vegetable gardens depend on irrigation. To see what plants would have grown in the city before the city was here, visit the Laura Smith Porter Plains Garden at Denver Botanic Gardens. <laughs>